Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for June 12th of 2024 is titled Aurora over Karkonoski Mountains. So what do we see here? Well, here we look over the mountains and then up in the sky see the very strong colors of the aurora. And these were taken just about a month ago during a very large solar storm which caused powerful aurora all over the earth and in fact visible at latitudes where they normally are not seen. Normally the aurora are seen far north, so very far northerly latitudes, things like Scandinavia and northern Canada and uh, Alaska, that's where we often see the images from them. However, during the large storm, the Earth's magnetic field is deformed and the particles that cause the aurora can then strike Earth's atmosphere at lower latitudes. So while you may not see them at the equator, you can see them at much more temperate latitudes than when they are typically visible. So here we see some of that aurora and the different colors up in the sky. And in this case, the purple color that we see, usually we see a green aurora, which is caused by oxygen atoms that are being excited by those particles. Now the purple on the other hand is caused by nitrogen atoms. So nitrogen atoms when excited give off purplish colors. So now these are different and that different colors that we see can tell us about different elements. Now within our atmosphere of course we know what the composition is because we can test it. But we can use similar things with stars and nebulae. And when we see them glowing the specific wavelengths they give us tell us something about their composition. And in fact, it is the one way we have to learn about what things are made up of outside of our own Earth and maybe some nearby objects within our solar system that we have been able to sample. Now we can expect a more aurora over the coming months as the sun is reaching a peak of its cycle. The sun peaks in its activity about once every 11 years and is due to peak again very soon. So we've been seeing a lot more aurora like this and can expect them to continue for the next year or so as the sun is very active and will have a lot of sunspots and a lot of solar flares and coronal mass ejections that throw off those particles which give us the aurora such as the one seen today. So we really have something to look forward to with that activity over the coming months and say maybe a year and a lot of us that live at lower latitudes will have the opportunity to see the aurora that normally are not visible where we live. So that was our picture of the day for June 12th of 2024. It was titled Aurora over Karkonoski Mountains. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be a star swirl. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.